Welcome to part 86 of the Male Hunter Baby Challenge, Season 2. And in this episode, Slinka and 792 age up, Bunny and Cleesby are born, also Stan works on skills and goes to GeekCon. So that's good. I never discussed the names from like when Tina and Genevieve, since Gen Tina and Genevieve were born? I don't think I have. Uh, Tina, she was the one of Ernst Longboard's colleagues that was into Kai. And she's always trying to flirt with him and stuff. And kiss him and whatever. And just, just, just trying to come on to him. And he really wasn't that into it because he's dead. And Genevieve, then after Pope Genevieve Girota from uh, Stand Down and Apocalypse Now. She was the Pope. Also, um, Slinka in 792. Slinka, she was one of the female androids in the TV world on that, and that's a laugh track. A show called Slinka and Yo Yo that um that uh Stan partaked in. Part no, I can't talk today. My, I'm st I'm still swollen and my lip is hurting and it's hard for me to talk right. Um. Okay. Uh, seven ninety two is the name of. Of uh, in in episode Twilight, there's a robot named Seven Ninety Two that heals Stan when he was sick from an unknown ailment. And of course, we got Bunny and Cleesby. Of course, Bunny is in First Lady Bunny, or Bunny from Game Town, in seasons three and four. Cleesby is uh. One of the guys in uh, episode Prime Ridge, who Zev tries to get with, and he's being bullied in the workplace by fellow co-workers, and they're all trying to get with, who are also trying to get with Zev, but Zev's not into it, because if Zev got with anyone at the work, because she got a job as a co-counselor or something like that, and a stress counselor. And the, if she flirted with anybody, she'd lose her job. <laughs> Anyways, just keep me up on dates on the names. Like I said, from the beginning, all the names were Lex names. All of them. And I found more, a hundred more, for the first gener two generations of Prince. And then I'm kind of recycling some names from that Stan you from the four generations of Stan. Kind of recycling names. Because I want the Male Hunter Baby Challenge Seasons 2 and 3 to have Lex names. Anyways. We're not looking for a new girlfriend anytime soon until... Some kids age up and move out. So. So, um. G Giselle Star will be with us for a while. That's fine. What? Well, it, 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 there's a rule that the. That the, that the Main Sim can't have a job, but it doesn't say that, <laughs> that anyone else can't. So, she, so any girlfriend that Stan moves in to keep track of the pregnancies, 
They can get jobs. He says, Stan doesn't. <laughs> he doesn't get a job. He doesn't in the end. I wish my lip didn't hurt so much. You know that blisters you get inside your lip? I mean, does it, sometimes you get blisters in your lip. Oh, that's what it feels like. And it's just the upper lip. I mean, on the inside of my lip. Oh my gosh, it hurts. You know, like an area where you're, uh, you know, like where, where the inside of your lip, the skin meets your gums it just oh, it freaking hurts and I can know about it to be honest I, I mean I let my toothache go so so long it just did this to me that swelling's going down little by little when it when my face was this, it hurts now. I can do about it. To complain about it, it doesn't help. Well, at least I can talk and make videos. Of course, the stereo was broken. Who broke it? I'm not kidding. Who who broke it? Ah, oh, Stanley. No, we already got girlfriends lined up. Oh, no, thank you. Thank you, but no, thank you. <laughs> See his dad asking for, his someone asking for your numbers, like, no. He's already got girlfriends lined up, so, no. At least we know that um, Bunny is an alien and Cleesby is a mermaid. Yeah. <laughs> We mostly got aliens. That's because Stan is an alien. I kind of changed them because I really want some interesting alien colors for my for my Sims. So I kind of went and cast and kind of changed their colors because I want their I want to to try all the different custom alien colors. Just trying them out. We're not a dark blue alien. You have a purple. What else have purple? You have a dark green alien. You can have a red or a dark red alien. You can have a yellow alien. Orange yellow alien. <laughs> I mean, come on. 
<laughs> it's cool. Are the colors of the rainbow aliens. I thought of a Halloween video where I do the Lex characters as vampires. I'm thinking about it. Maybe I should. Well, I'm not. Here's what I'm gonna have to do. I'm gonna have to. Um, I get my, uh, my original Lex characters I've already made. Play them a little bit. Going, going to game mode with life mode with them. And use them to answer and turn them into vampires. And then go in the cast and fix them up. So I know they have the disguise and the, their dark form. and I could work on that. That would be a good Halloween video. You know what? There's more stuff to do in Stan's house than there is in any other place you go to. <laughs> like the guys night, that bar in Windebird. Not much to do there. There's plenty of stuff to do here. That's why Stan didn't go. Because <laughs> there's plenty more stuff to do here. A lot of stuff. Why abandon that so you can do nothing? It's pretty stupid. Oh, Greg, I named some other people's kids. Nice. Not nice. <laughs> I really don't want to. It's different if it was a Hi Baby Challenge Grandparent Edition, like I did with Kai. But no, it's not working here. <laughs> it's, it's pointless here. I tried turning that off, but it doesn't want to turn off. Still keep sending me birth notifications, even though I turn that off. Anyway, it's always hanging out with their grandma, and I figured I got some time to make videos. More like do commentary for videos. So that's what I'm doing right now. Gr uh, Frank's mom won't take her for a night unless her laptop is fixed. Oh, crap. He still hasn't got her fixed. He swore he got a new power adapter for her laptop. It's been, what, two weeks? Where is it? I think he lied. It's getting that time of year. It's almost the first day of fall. Right now it's Saturday. And 
falls just two days away. Usually when it's fall, the first thing I think about is Halloween and Thanksgiving. It's the best parts about fall. Bring it on, man. Bring it on. I like fall and thanks fall. I like Halloween and Thanksgiving. Bring it on. I think November is, there's going to be a moment where I'm going to be taking a break, okay? Because, seriously, I've been, just, wait a second, there is an episode where third generation stand crashes in a um in a, in a rocket. Why can't I say rocket? My mouth my mouth hurts. And this from my tooth egg and the earth canal just all together and just after no we can't wore off. Oh my gosh. So did you win anything? He failed. Oh gosh, that's, that sucks. <laughs> he failed the ultimate gaming test. That sucks. Just been hackathon. He's just letting everybody know he's an alien. <laughs> he's just not afraid to hide it. Is it weird seeing Stanley Tweedle as an alien or what? <laughs> it's fun to play him as an alien. Don't get me wrong. It's fun. I had a really good time playing play him. I mean, it was different because he was an alien. You're looking like this, the third, the, the fourth generation's a mermaid. And he's also going to be red. <laughs> hey, it's his dad. Both two Stanley Tweedles in the same place. It's not the one who invited him here. Okay, Stan hooks up with an alien and marries her and has a kid named Stanley Tweedle, who is an alien. And he's surprised that his son's an alien. <laughs> Remember that one episode he was surprised that his son was an alien? How? You married, an, you married his mother who was an alien. What do you expect was going to happen? That he wasn't, he, 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 your child wasn't going to be, your project wasn't going to be an alien? I mean, think about it. <laughs> you marry an alien, and the child you have with her, you didn't think he was gonna be, he was gonna, your project was going to be an alien? Stan, I, the second generation, some sense, I swear. 
Act stupid. I'm gonna spy on some neighbors. <laughs> we should. <laughs> The hackathon has the hackathon has come to an end, and Heidi Sue has a score of sixty nine to hundred. Well, good for her. Oh, yes, yeah, this is the episode where he rides the rocket ship and he crashes. This is the episode. Finish fixing it though. Oh. Explore space. Yes, we're going to do just that. Yeah, this is the episode where he crashes. Oh my gosh, it's the first time this ever happened since I played with the ro rocket science career. Well, the rocket science skill in general. Interspace, of course. You know, and after this moment, I saved my game. Little full rocket skill. That's nice. <gasps> Crash! Oh! This is where I thought he was gonna die. <laughs> Stan! No! And nobody asked if he was okay? Ah! Oh. And nobody asked if he was okay. Ah, that's brutal. Anyway, this is the end of this episode, so stay tuned for part. 87.